Marley and Megan have been working hard to become B students in school. During this time, Megan has been living as an in-house nanny for the neighbors who has a daughter. Occasionally, she may need a study session with Marley, so she would invite Marley over to the neighbor's house since she has to babysit most of the time, even when the parents are home, so they can have a study session. So, in time, Marley becomes close to the parents as well as the infant being cared for. It's almost Dawson's birthday when Marley is starting to feel sick. She is realizing her period is late and she'd been gaining weight, but she had assumed it was from stress of her final exams coming up. Her mom sat her down and said, Mars, her nickname that only her mom can call her, and said, are you by any chance pregnant? As she noticed she was gaining weight, Marley instantly became defensive, immediately saying, Mom, I'm not even having woohoo. Mom said, Okay, I understand. As time goes on, Marley continues to gain weight. Then one night, she's in severe pain, to which she's freaking out and heading to the hospital to find out she is giving birth to a child. Her father taught her young on the morals of life about being honest and loyal. So when he found out that his teen daughter willingly had woohoo with a married man, he flipped and told her she could no longer live there anymore and that she made her bed, she must lay in it. So now Marley is living on her own in this one bedroom home. So my name is Kimmy, if you're new here. Today we are doing a new season and that is season four of my Teen Runaway Challenge. If you've seen the last few, the last three seasons, you know that I have a theme for all of my series as to why they ran away as a teen so if you want to catch up real quick major ran away due to a tragic car accident and he had a teen girlfriend pregnant millie who had a drug addiction so she ended up raising four babies and then you have marion who ran away because he being child neglected and decided to kidnap basically his siblings and raised him as his own and then marley just got in trouble with her parents especially her father because he raised her on loyalty and honesty and she ended up getting pregnant by a married man that she knew was married and didn't care basically <laughs> we used some of the items in the house that she was given and the other items that just didn't work you guys so this is the house let me give you guys a quick little rundown of the place this is the home i'm pretty sure I've downloaded this building off the gallery i'm not 100 percent sure as to what the name was but it's definitely not mine now the inside i did some tweaking of it because i needed to <laughs> there's not a lot of room in here and i really needed to get some space in here so i tweaked a lot of these rooms up as you can see i have a bed here that she did get uh, we did get, um, nothing else, honestly. I couldn't find anything else for her to use, unfortunately. This is her daughter. She had a girl named, I named her Mabel. So that is that. So we are going to be living here with her daughter and three dogs in hopes of becoming a well-known veterinarian. This is the baby daddy. If you don't recognize him, I made him as a sim by himself. He's a Scottish sim and he is married to his wife i did go through and edit some people i don't remember if i edit everybody or not because there's so many people but we have amy Miriam, ali lacy not lace lacy and megan i am probably going to work towards getting her and the father of her child to stay together because they're really cute let me show you some pictures of them together if you haven't seen the beginning I find them super cute together, so I do want them to ship them towards the end. Maybe he, he gets a divorce from his wife and they co-parent their daughter, or maybe his wife meets her untimely demise and they finally get together then. I don't know, but basically, that's my idea. And the bill to pay is $283. Don't have any projects right now, so I don't have how many more days a little worried about how this is all gonna work in this tiny little place but we do have a bathtub to bathe our newborn and our animals we do have food for the dogs and we we do have the ability to feed mabel and i love the name mabel so cute i went with the m name so i am gonna have her work on grabbing some stuff like this i'm also very tempted on making this a off the grid okay y'all better not get pregnant over there 
So I do plan on working on making a graveyard. I just haven't had a chance to do it yet. I've been so busy. Um, I do still do Facebook requests if anyone wants to do any. I do it for both Sims and builds. I had someone recently ask me about a Brit and Tiff, a teenage robot. So I do do that. So if you guys ever want me to do something for you, just let me know. So what you make? One bowl? Yeah, you made one bowl of ramen. That's great. You gonna eat it now? Good. So what are they doing? They better not be making any babies on my watch. I'm telling you. Okay, so I looked. Apparently, I don't think they can get pregnant on their own. But um, since they were flirting and doing all that stuff, I decided to let them encourage the mate just for storyline purposes. And they did. Elle is pregnant with two. It's twins. So we have a male and a female puppy coming. So that's great. But it's just, just too many dogs. <laughs> I don't want more. It's got to fit in this mess. But she is. She's pregnant with puppies. We're almost to fifth generation. I did say after my fifth generation, I'll probably give this series a break and go to something else. And I'm thinking of going to back to my 100 baby challenge. I'm already at 50% of it. And I would like to get that challenge completed. And do the other 50 that we have left with the infants. And I think it'd be kind of fun. I don't know how long pregnancy is. I want to take a couple days. She just found out she was pregnant. So does it tell her? It does not. So I'm not sure that I don't know what the name Oh, what the huh? Okay, so we got baby names now. I'm gonna go see if I can find any names in the Discord. Kinsey. One name and name him Jason. So that's done. Oh, they are so cute too. Look at the coloring of them. I really hope that one of them ends up like the cup size of Bell but different shading. This one is Jason. So Jason's orange and Kenzie is a cute little white. Look at little Kaysen and his mom. He's literally about the size of her. Oh my gosh, she is so adorable. You know what, we'll go to school. We'll get out of the house, give y'all something to watch this episode. First thing we're going to do is run to a bathroom. The very first bathroom we can. Are these like, yeah, nope. Can't tell, okay. So we just have to go to one of these bathrooms and use it. I know you got to go gear, so go ahead and get yourself in there. Where you pee yourself, and that would be like monkey see, monkey do, right? Let her join that real quick. I don't know if it's part of her stuff or not, but someone playing football and the thing, getting ready for school. Attend study. Prep. Not sure how to do this, so complete a project. I can always buy a project if TV. Finish homework while focused, which she's never gonna be focused. And it's just math class. Hello, he's self absorbed and a snob. I'm sorry, if you're going to be a teacher, I'd imagine. That you would be not self-absorbed. <laughs> and she's not hungry. She's raising a, a newborn on her own. She's got five dogs to care for. So she would obviously be in need of a... She's here. She barely made it to class. But we're going to go ahead and go home. Also, I should let you guys know. She moved to Copperdale to live near the school. Because she got kicked out. So she figured it's best to be near the school. We're going to bring over Calum. Alright, so we are here. And this is Callum. Isn't he cute? See, look at them. They're like super cute together. Is she getting acne? Am I seeing things? These are little babies. They're so adorable. They don't play with each other. Oh, they're so cute. Aww. Let's go ahead and. There you go. I want to also introduce the baby to Callum. He's so cute. Marcel wants to go. I'm busy at the moment. Can't do that. But let's see what she gets. One, two, two three she's a wiggly worm um hello where'd she go is it gonna see me people in there i'm so confused right now where is the baby so i have been sitting here for the last few minutes and my game is not wanting to let me do anything so with that said i'm just gonna have to leave it here because my game's not gonna work with me right now so with that said i will see you guys later and hopefully by next episode i'll have this situation fixed for you guys bye